Hi and welcome back to another video. So today I'm going to teach you how to screen record restricted apps on Android. So screen recording restricted apps on Android can be challenging because many apps have implemented security measures to prevent unauthorized recording. However, there are a few methods you can try to screen record restricted apps on Android. But please note that these methods may not work for all apps as developers actively work to prevent screen recording and additionally, it is important to respect the app's terms of service and not use screen recording to violate any restrictions or privacy policies. So here are a few methods you can attempt. So first is screen recording apps. So there are third-party screen recording apps available on Google Play Store that can bypass some, apps some app restrictions. So these apps often uh, use different techniques like overlaying a recording button or utilizing internal recording APIs. So example of such include AZ Screen, Re AZ screen Recorder, MobiZen Screen Recorder, or ADV Screen Recorder. So next, what you can do is external devices. So another option is to use external hardware devices such as capture cards or hdmi recorders so to, rec to record the screen of your android devices and this method involves connecting your phone or tablet to external device and then recording the screen output of the external device Num third is to mirroring Third is mirroring and recording. So some screen mirroring apps like a power mirror or visor allow you to mirror your Android device's screen to a computer. So once mirrored, you can use screen recording software on your computer, such as OBS Studio or Bandicam to record the mirrored screen. Next is routing. So routing your Android device provides you with Elevated privileges, which can potentially enable you to bypass app restrictions and use screen recording apps or methods that require deeper system access. However, please note that routing your device can void its warranty and it should be done with caution and knowledge of risks involved. Just remember, the effectiveness of these methods can vary dep depending on the app and device you are using and it is important to respect up developers restriction and privacy policies and use these methods responsibly so that is all for this video and i hope you learned something and if you did please make sure to like this video subscribe to the channel and click the notification bell button so you won't miss a video thank you very much for watching and have a great rest of the day Bye bye